Sarah Neville, sweetly sing you into dreamland. HBO family, family. Family HBO. What do you get when you bring music, magical animation, and merry children together? Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa. A spirited seasonal surprise. There was a half of a cookie. So we know that Santa was not that hungry. With songs from today's top stars and musical legends, including Louis Armstrong, Nat King Cole, Bing Crosby, Judy Garland, Los Lobos, Bette Midler, and Frank Sinatra. I see trees of green. Red roses too. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Yuletide gay. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. So join HBO for the holiday special, Twas the Night. Premieres Wednesday at 6.30 on HBO Family. My dog is way cooler than your dog. My dog drives a car. He plays baseball. Unless they can build a cellar in a day. A cellar in a day. Can they do it? Join me, Robert Klein, and find out as Mike and his team shovel come to life in this animated tale. We always work fast when someone is watching us. What do a floppy-eared bunny, a shimmering stingray, a pot-bellied pig, and a trio of cool cats all have in common? They have a special touch. He really likes you. That can make all the difference in someone's life. <laughs> HBO presents a very special evening to celebrate these exceptional animals. I think he's just a really funny-looking dog. And their companions. I think animals can sense when people need a little extra love. Join me, Mary Tyler Moore, in Three Cats from Miami and other pet practitioners. Tell me what a cloud is made of. Clouds aren't made of cotton candy, even though they look soft and fluffy way up there in the sky. Clouds are really millions of tiny droplets of water. When the water in the clouds gets too heavy, it will fall back to Earth as rain or snow. And now you know. Bear. Happily ever after. Oh, well. In the underwater world of Rainbow Fish, based on the award winning book, every day at 10 a.m. on HBO Family's Jam. <laughs> Next on Jam. Storybook Musicals. Storybook Musicals. Jam. Eat it with a spoon. A new day is dawning in fairy tale land, and the stars have never shined brighter. Like Paul Rodriguez in The Fisherman and His Wife. Hey, you wanna chill out? He's got a few tricks up his fins. Amazing. What can I say? I'm an amazing fish. That send a love-struck fisherman into a tailspin. Edward James almost doesn't ask for much. What I'd really like is a beautiful new dress for my wife, Tina. That's it? But Julia McGinnis just can't get enough. Compared to this beautiful dress, everything else we have seems... 
crummy. And before you can say pescado, this chica's in over her head. Go to the fish and tell him to make me queen of the gypsies. I hope I'm not bothering you. No, 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 no. I'm just training with the dolphins, huh? The moral of this tale? If you're gonna fall hook, line, and sinker for every fish story... Be careful what you fish for, homeboy! Wishes can come true! Don't miss The Fisherman and His Wife, a magical fable with a flamenco beat. Happily Ever After, fairy tales for every child. window thinking. It's Mom's birthday tomorrow, and Dad and I don't know what to give her. <laughs> There's a painter in the courtyard painting our house. Hmm. Artists are good at painting things. Like people, for example. That's what they call a portrait. Just think if she could paint me. Hmm? Hmm. Ah. What a perfect present ah. for Mum. <laughs> oh. I'm going to paint a self-portrait and give it to Mum. When painting self-portraits, you need a mirror so you can see what you look like. First you start with a ball. That's the head. And then a small little round thing. That's my nose. Eyes are windows that you can open and close. And the mouth is a road going from cheek to cheek. Go. All done. Not bad at all. I'm sure Mum will get very happy when she gets my portrait. I show my painting to Dad. Dad likes my painting, but he cannot see what it is. What is it meant to be? asks Dad. I tell Dad that the thing in the painting is me and that I'm going to give it to Mum. But I don't want to give Mum this painting anymore. Dad can't even tell what it is. Dad is ashamed of himself and feels sorry for me. I can paint your portrait if you want, Lisa, he says. and paints. <laughs> but the painting doesn't look like me at all. It looks more like a plate of bacon and eggs. I tell Dad 
that we can ask the painter if she can help us. I'm sure she's very good at painting people. But when we look out at the courtyard, the painter is gone. That's too bad. Now we'll have to give Mom something else. Somebody's at the door. It's the painter. She has just painted a picture of our apartment building. And wonders if the little girl in the window is here. <laughs> the painter shows us her painting. It's a painting of her house, and I can see myself sitting in one of the windows. Dad and I think the painting is very pretty. It's almost like a portrait of me with a house around it. You're a very talented painter, says Dad. I can't paint at all. likes Dad's painting very much. She says that bacon and eggs are her son's favorite food. And it's his birthday tomorrow. That bacon painting would be a perfect present for him, she says. Would he like to trade paintings? I showed the artist my painting, too. Now that's the best self-portrait I've seen in a long time, says the artist. And then the artist rushes home with her bacon and eggs painting. Mom's not only getting one painting for her birthday, she's getting two. And both of them are me. hibiscus flower feels before it shrivels and drops to the floor. Perhaps you've never seen a mouse dancing in a pink frock. Such things can happen to you. Who? You! When a marzipan pig falls behind the sofa, Tim Curry narrates the charming story of the marzipan pig on this HBO storybook musical. Once upon a time, in a land not too far away, there lived a brave and noble prince called... Hold up. That story is so, well, old school. Hello. Are you ready to hear your favorite fairy tales from a fresh point of view? Yes! Then turn on HBO Family for the jam and animated series, Happily Ever After. Fairy tales for every child. Wow. Hollywood's mega stars are the voices behind our heroes and scoundrels. <laughs> Plus, jam with the characters to today's hottest musical flavors. Latin, 
reggae, country, and soul. We've got them all. This is the story of the year. So check out the hippest animated series around every morning at 8.30 and again at 2.30 p.m. That's exactly what I'm going to do starting bright and early tomorrow morning. Feel the magic only on HBO Family Jam. Jamie, so <laughs> Why the bear has a short tail based on the folklore of Russia. Long ago, bears had tails twice as long as a cat's, but they didn't do much good. Their tails just sat there, like that. One bear had a thought that his tail could catch fish, so he put it in the water and waited with his dish. Well, the bear got a bite, but the bite had a price. The fish bit his tail off, and it didn't feel nice. Now today, all bears' tails are short, round, and soft, and bears watch where they sit so they don't get bit off. Mr. Bear, oh, Mr. Bear, he gets around almost anywhere. Oh, Mr. Bear, he just don't care. He got no clothes, just lots of hair. He likes to climb up in a tree to look for honey from the bee. Or he might catch a couple of fishes. You might see him poke around in a log or underground. And when he sits, he sits wherever he wishes. Mr. Bear, oh Mr. Bear, he gets around, he just don't care. And when it gets late in the fall, he'll curl up into a ball and fall asleep inside his cozy den. All during winter time, he gets along just fine. And when springtime rolls around, he'll do it all again. That Mr. Bear, oh Mr. Bear, he gets around almost anywhere. Oh, Mr. Bear, you just don't care. You got no clothes, just lots of hair. Imagine a bubbling world where the new kid in class is a seahorse? Nice! Where you can order from an octopus or play hide and seek in the seaweed? I don't know about you guys, but I'm ripping this time. It's all in a day's adventure. Whoa! <clears throat> oh, well. In the underwater world of Rainbow Fish, based on the award winning book. Every day at 10 a.m. on HBO Family's Jam. The never-ending story. Join young Bastion as he journeys through the land of Fantasia while meeting new friends. Jackal's the name. And battling old foes. Bastion Bumps, you are mine. HBO Family, the never-ending story. Every day at 10.30 on HBO Family's Jam. <laughs> Happily Ever After, The Little Lulu Show. Next on Jam. Storybook Musicals. Storybook Musicals. Jam! Eat it with a spoon. Spread the word. Get ready to jam every morning with HBO Family. Wow. Starting at 6 a.m., get a taste of royal life with Babar. Then at 6.30, <laughs> George and Martha discover life is sweeter when shared with friends. At 7 o'clock, hang out with Bob the Ball and his zany friends in the animated series, A Little Curious. Whoa. Next, at 
7.30, we're sweetening the mix. Get ready for the splashing new series, Harold and the Purple Crayon. Pull up a chair for kindergarten. Or put on your thinking cap with encyclopedia. Then at 8, jam with the lovable characters in the storybook musicals. At 8.30, classic fairy tales come to life with a twist. Happily Ever After, fairy tales for every child. Next at 9, it's everyone's favorite comedian in The Little Lulu Show. Following at 9.30, this lovable bear doesn't look for sticky situations, they just seem to find him. The Adventures of Paddington Bear. And at 10, Rainbow and his sea friends make a splash in the animated series Rainbow Fish. Plus, we're jamming again from 11 to 2 with more episodes of all your favorite shows. Wow! It's jam time. Every day on the all-new HBO family. Jam. Eat with a spoon. Get a mouse-sized view of a world filled with adventure. And the country mouse and the city mouse. Let's go. Go global with quick-witted cousins Emily and Alexander and their many mouse pals. They're mice on a mission as they scurry to solve giant-sized mysteries. Aha! Uh -huh. From cable car capers... Hang on! to dastardly doings around the world. Jeez Louise, I've been found out! These little guys prove there are no pipsqueaks as they take you on a mountain-sized tour. Whoa! Set sail with the Country Mouse and the City Mouse Adventures every day at 11 a.m. on HBO Family's Jam. I love Jammy, because Jammy is so silly. A new day's dawning in fairy tale land. <laughs> and the stars have never shined brighter. <laughs> The music's never been hotter. Check out John Cicada in 12 Dancing Princesses. I have been having this dream And crazy as it may seem Charm and good looks Everything that I don't know about love Could fill up a volume of books Que boba ser con una princesa Cuando tiene millones para escoger And as one Chances are good as a prince that I have an upgrade. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I am so easy to read. A bit too tall and not neat.
Come celebrate a whole new season of Happily Ever After. Fairy tales for every child. On HBO Family. Next on Jam. Storybook Musicals. Storybook Musicals. Jam. Eat it with a spoon. He's the main man in a minuscule world. Ha ha ha. He's got everyone buzzing about him. Isn't he so chivalrous and romantic? And along with his gang of Lilliputian partners. That'll keep him busy for a while. They prove that no adventure is too big or too small for that matter. This calls for a celebration. He's Anthony Ant and he's on HBO Family in a new animated series. Anthony Ant, weekdays at 8 a.m. and 1.30 p.m. on HBO Family's Jam. He's an eloquent dancer. Only a bear would do the tango at half past six on a Saturday morning. That won't go anywhere without a smile and a marmalade sandwich. You're the stickiest bear I've ever met. So who is this furry fella? Paddington Bear, ready for duty, Admiral. Paddington Bear, the classic storybook character. I think that's me. In a new animated series, The Adventures of Paddington Bear. You should try it sometime. Happily Ever After, The Little Lulu Show. That's on Jam! Happily Ever After, Fairy Tales for Every Child. We're jamming on Jam today. <laughs> Play with Jammy on HBO Family's Morning for Preschoolers. Jam will bounce, stretch, and wiggle from one great show to another. Jamming with old friends or meeting new ones. Get a taste of what a real day of school is like with the cool new show Kindergarten. Plus, life's one wild adventure in the new series Harold and the Purple Crayon. It's a day jam-packed with wonder and imagination. It's Jam on HBO Family. Like kings! An entire city of gold awaits them. Big smile, like you mean it. But they have to get there first. Holy shit! These chickens are cooking up a little surprise. The plan is we go over the wire. <laughs> oh, no chicken escapes from Tweedy's farm. Now he's the only chance they've got. The name's Rocky. Hi, how are you? And what brings you to England? All the beautiful English chicks, of course. We're all going to fly over that fence, and Mr. Rhodes is going to show us how. Did you say... Fly? Chicken run. Which punk is mine? Tell me what a cloud is made of. Clouds aren't made of cotton candy, even though they look soft and fluffy way up there in the sky. Clouds are really millions of tiny droplets of water. When the water in the clouds gets too heavy, it will fall back to Earth as rain or snow. And now you know. The never-ending story. Next on Jam, The Little Lulu Show! Jam, eat it with a spoon. 
Spread the word. Get ready to jam every morning with HBO Family. Wow. Starting at 6 a.m., get a taste of royal life with Babar. Then at 6.30, <laughs> George and Martha discover life is sweeter when shared with friends. At 7 o'clock, hang out with Bob the Ball and his zany friends in the animated series, A Little Curious. Next, at 7.30, we're sweetening the mix. Get ready for the splashing new series, Harold and the Purple Crayon. Pull up a chair for kindergarten or put on your thinking cap with encyclopedia. Then at 8, jam with the lovable characters in the storybook musicals. At 8.30, classic fairy tales come to life with a twist. Happily Ever After, fairy tales for every child. Next at 9, it's everyone's favorite comedian in The Little Lulu Show. Following at 9.30, this lovable bear doesn't look for sticky situations, they just seem to find him. The Adventures of Paddington Bear. And at 10, Rainbow and his sea friends make a splash in the animated series Rainbow Fish. Plus, we're jamming again from 11 to 2 with more episodes of all your favorite shows. Wow! It's jam time. Every day on the all-new HBO family. Jam. Eat with a spoon. Love that book. Everybody's got a favorite book. What's yours? Chicka chicka boom boom. Chicka chicka boom boom. You dog right. <laughs> My favorite book. Watch for it between shows on HBO Jam. Let's read it again. It's yeah. great. The never-ending story. Join young Bastion as he journeys through the land of Fantasia while meeting new friends. Jackal's the name. And battling old foes. Bastion Bumps, you are mine. HBO Family, the never-ending story. Every day at 10.30 on HBO Family's Jam. I love Jam because Jam is so sweet. <laughs> How do you make chickens do more than cross the road? Well, Chicken Run's creators use claymation, a stop-action technique in which clay figures are chained slightly in between camera shots in order to create the illusion of movement. Watch in this scene as Rocky, voiced by Mel Gibson, starts his quest for a few good hen. The name's Rocky. Rocky the Rhode Island Red. Rhodes for short. Rocky Rhodes. Catchy, ain't it? Um, Mr. Rhodes, is this you? Uh, who wants to know? group of rather desperate chickens. You see, if it is you, then you just might be the answer to our prayers. Well then, call me a miracle, dollface. Because that's me. And what brings you to England, Mr. Rhodes? Why, all the beautiful English chicks, of course. Oh, See, I'm a traveler by nature. I did that whole barnyard thing for a while, but I couldn't really get into it. Hi, how are you? Nope. The open road, that's more my style. Yeah, just give me a pack on my back and point me where the wind blows. In fact, you know what they call me back home? You're going to The Lone Free Ranger. Isn't that great? It's possible. Oh, it's possible, all right. I knew the answer would come. Amen. We're all going to fly over that fence, and Mr. Rhodes is going to show us how. Chicken Run, this month on HBO Family. Next on Jam, The Little Lulu Show. Jam, eat it with a spoon. Boom, ba, 
son of a Meet the newest members of the HBO family, Bob the Ball, Little Cup, Pat and Pencil, and the rest of their animated friends in Curious. A Little Curious, a brand new show that teaches preschoolers about the very curious world around them. God, it was sticky. Couldn't have said it better myself. A Little Curious. A Little Curious. That I like. Every day at 7 a.m. and 12.30 p.m. on HBO Family's Jam. Ever wish that all your dreams could come true? Then don't miss Harold and the Purple Crayon, the splashing new series from HBO Family. With just a little imagination and a purple crayon, Harold can turn an ordinary night into a really big adventure. Play musical chairs with a clumsy moose, or make friends with a mermaid and play under the sea. Where will Harold's curiosity take him next? And will he make it home in time for breakfast? In his world, anything's possible. Don't miss the new series, Harold and the Purple Crayon, based on the acclaimed children's books by Crockett Johnson. Don't miss the fun, only on HBO Family. The never-ending story. up a little surprise. The plan is we go over the wire. Uh, oh, no chicken escapes from Tweedy's farm. Now he's the only chance they've got. The name's Rocky. Hi, how are you? And what brings you to England? All the beautiful English chicks, of course. We're all going to fly over that fence and Mr. Rhodes is going to show us how. Did you say fly? Chicken run. Which bunk is mine? What do a floppy-eared bunny, a shimmering stingray, a pot-bellied pig, and a trio of cool cats all have in common? They have a special touch. He really likes you. That can make all the difference in someone's life. <laughs> HBO presents a very special evening to celebrate these exceptional animals. Thinks he's just a really funny-looking dog. And their companions. I think animals can sense when people need a little extra love. Join me, Mary Tyler Moore, in Three Cats from Miami and other pet practitioners. I love Jamie, because Jamie's so squishy. A favorite book? Do you really, really love it? A lot, 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 lot. Never, ever, ever. When I lose it, and you want to read it every single day. For every, like, five minutes of your life, you love this book. Very really really much. That's what it means, your favorite book. My favorite book. It's about a cat who likes sushi and she eats it every day for her school lunch. Yeah, that's sushi. It's about sushi. It's a Chinese Jap food. No, Japanese. A Japanese food. It's rice wrapped in dry seaweed. Mm. Seaweed? Ooh. Yuck. <laughs> <laughs> but the kids laughed at her. They say, na, 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 you don't eat like us. It's so rude. Yoko was feeling bad because people were teasing her about the sushi. The teacher had an idea. 
Dear parents, Monday will be International Food Day. They were supposed to dry everybody's food just to make Yoko feel bad at <laughs> I'll bring some food from Bangladesh. I would bring Muzaka from Greece. French pies, Chinese noodles, platanos, and mooncakes. I would just try to see if I like it. Sometimes it tastes good, sometimes it doesn't. And Yoko brings um, sushi again. again. No one had touched even one piece of Yoko's sushi. How would that feel? Very bad, bad. Timothy, he was so hungry he would eat anything, ah. and then he tried one of those sushi. He liked it. <laughs> he liked it. <laughs> Well, my parents are from Poland, but they eat Chinese food. That's interesting. He's an eloquent dancer. Only a bear would do the tango at half past six on a Saturday morning. That won't go anywhere without a smile and a marmalade sandwich. You're the stickiest bear I've ever met. So who is this furry fella? Paddington Bear, ready for duty, Admiral. Paddington Bear, the classic storybook character. I think that's me. In a new animated series, The Adventures of Paddington Bear. You should try it sometime. Get a mouse-sized view of a world filled with adventure. And the country mouse and the city mouse. Let's go. Go global with quick-witted cousins Emily and Alexander and their many mouse pals. They're mice on a mission as they scurry to solve giant-sized mysteries. Uh -huh. From cable car capers. Hang on tight, everyone. I'm rich. To <laughs> dastardly doings around the world. Jeez Louise, I've been found out. These little guys prove there are no pipsqueaks as they take you on a mountain-sized tour. Whoa! Set sail with the Country Mouse and the City Mouse Adventures every day at 11 a.m. on HBO Family's Jam. on HBO Family. Today on Jam! Paddington Bear, Rainbow Fish, The Never-Ending Story. Next on Jam, Rainbow Fish. Rainbow Fish! Rainbow Fish. <laughs> Come play with Jammy on HBO Family's Morning for Preschoolers, Jam. We'll bounce, stretch, and wiggle from one great show to another. Jamming with old friends or meet new ones. Get a taste of what a real day of school is like with the cool new show, Kindergarten. Plus, life's one wild adventure in the new series, Harold and the Purple Crayon. It's a day jam-packed with wonder and imagination. It's Jam on HBO Family. Meet the newest members of the HBO family, Bob the Ball, Little Cup, Pat and Pencil, and the rest of their animated friends in Curious. A Little Curious, a brand new show that teaches preschoolers about the very curious world around them. That was sticky. Couldn't have said it better myself. <laughs> a Little Curious. That I like. Every day at 7 a.m. and 12.30 p.m. on HBO Family's Jam. Ever wish that all your dreams could come true? Then don't miss Harold and the Purple Crayon, the splashing new series from HBO Family. With just a little imagination and a purple crayon, Harold can turn an ordinary night into a really big adventure. 
play musical chairs with a clumsy moose, or make friends with a mermaid and play under the sea. Where will Harold's curiosity take him next? And will he make it home in time for breakfast? In his world, anything's possible. Don't miss the new series, Harold and the Purple Crayon, based on the acclaimed children's books by Crockett Johnson. Don't miss the fun, only on HBO Family. How the Skunks Got Their Stink, based on the folklore of Saskatchewan. Once there were three brothers, each of them a skunk. Two of them were big and strong, and one was a runt. The runt missed out on berries growing high in the trees. While his brothers leaped the branches, he was falling on his knees. The tiny skunk was angry. He hated being small, and he didn't like the teasing from his brothers, not at all. Now anger isn't pretty, cause it puts you in a funk. He turned and sprayed his brothers, and boy, those skunks stunk. Now to this day, all skunks can make a stink. You don't want to get them angry. At least that's what I think. Waddling down the street, searching all around for something to eat. White toupee and a bushy old tail, making his way down the old food trail. A tiny black face with a shiny nose, he's the center of attention wherever he goes. And when he gets close, he's quite a sight in a black and white tux, going skunker tonight. What's that smell I'm sniffing in the air? Stinky, stanky, funky derriere. Rotten junk, take a whiff. Steaming gunk, what's the diff? Looking for some grub to stuff in his face. Those little tiny feet cover lots of ground. Down by the boondock, skunking around. Down by the boondock, skunking around. Whoa. Next on Jam. Rainbow fish. Rainbow fish. Rainbow fish. <laughs> Get your weekends off to a swinging start with HBO Family and Storybook Musicals. Timeless tales that will touch you. I'm glad I'm home. With music that will move you. We are gonna have fun, fun, fun. Ready to start jamming and grooving with HBO Storybook Musicals. Every Saturday and Sunday at 8 a.m. and 1.30 p.m. on HBO Jam. The cutest comic of all time. Listen up, TV people. She's lovable, high-spirited, enchanting, with a heart of gold and a mind of her own. You just wait. <sighs> Giving as good as she gets. <laughs> And getting what she deserves. Meet President Lulu. So let her tickle your funny bone. The Little Lulu Show. On HBO Family. HBO Family 411. Cool tips that'll make you hip. Serve mom and dad breakfast in bed. You don't have to cook. Just bring them simple things like cereal, juice, and toast. It will fill up their tummies and fill up their hearts. HBO Family 411. Hip tips. And City Mouse Adventures. Bad Bar. George and Martha. Whoa. 